Shit, finally finished defrosting. How long has it been? Eh, just the weekend. Eh, well, time to start. Holy shit, is that the Soldier Boy console? I must have it! Yes! Ultimate power! Yes! Pokemon Fusion! A game about Pokemon, but you mash them together into a new abomination. Oh! Ew! Dude! What the fuck? Today, I'll be playing it and trying to survive this follow. And our goal for this is gonna be pretty simple. What we're gonna do is look for the following. One Lapuni and one Gardevoir, because everyone in the world who is into Pokemon is somewhat fucked up in the head. Also, because why the fuck not? And our goal is also to beat the game regularly. I may do a Nuzlocke if I feel a bit dangerous, but for now, I have no idea how this game goes, so I'm just gonna keep it normal. But that, I hope you enjoy the video, and uh, yeah, enjoy! So first, we hop into the world of Pokemon. We set our age to the maximum, which is 17, since it would allow us to be 30 year old in their mother's basement. We set our mode to normal since that's what we feel, and now we are ready to begin. A new age will change after this product called DNA Splicers. This device allows one to combine two Pokemon DNA to a stronger abomination of a creature. Then we are greeted home, because after finishing watching The Office, season 2 of course, not the whole thing, we dashed downstairs and our mother threw us a letter that we got accepted into this Pokemon League, and then we had an option to name our rival. We decided to name them Lugie due to the years before we called him short. <laughs> Still haven't got over it. Suddenly, Luki came out of nowhere, then disrespect me again, and well, we just took it like a champ, obviously because uh, we're a bit submissive in this game. Then we went home and got home, and our stepmother, who's been with our mom for a, a bit now, gave us a pair of running shoes, which is very helpful, so hopefully, she keeps mom happy. But then we ran over to Professor Oak to get ourselves our new Pokemon, and the one we got was basic bitch Charmander. While Luigi being a bitch, combining the Pulbasaur and the Squirtle into a Squirtsaur, the worst thing I have ever heard of, and it scares me to this day still. Now we got our ass beat completely, and Lugi boasted about it, and well, he left. We catch our first Pokemon, a Ratatata, naming it OH SHIT! A RAT! Upon that, we arrived to the next town, and the gym there was closed for some reason, so we started to go to the forest, then we ran into a Ladybug, a Ladybug Pokemon, and then we caught it, and formally called it Lady Bitch. Suddenly, another Pokemon came out called Paris, we decided, you know what, let's call her, who's in Paris? Because obviously, we all know who's in Paris, by the way. Looking deeper into the forest, just like how my doctor looks off my ass for that little bit of cancer, we ran into a Meowth, and honestly, you know who we had to call it. Meowba. Concerning all things. Then all of a sudden, a Pichu came across, and I said, this is a perfect time to name it after Chris Chan's OC. Piss Chew. We do come across a trainer, but we slap them back to the Shadow Realms where they belong. Then I realized that we could get into this Frankenstein shit, so we decided to combine a few Pokemon and we decided to call Meowba and Lady Bitch into. It's hideous, obviously, but upon more exploration, there was this hotel that allowed you to get points to get rewards for doing achievements, basically. Which is very nice, but I got a new Pokemon called Iggly Buff. So, I decided to call it after my grandfather, Bowling Ball. Soon fusing Bowling Ball with a Cleffa called Little Demon, which made this little demon of hell called... <laughs> Then combining my piss chew and my noodle arena poison to the ultimate form called But 
then after that, I realized that, wait, I haven't been to the gym. So I decided to get on my grind, grind my pub and training them to their limits. The minus. Practically the beefcakes of legends. And after that, I realized, wait, I need the classics. So I looked out into the forest, found a carapy, scooped that shit up. Then I said, you know, I think I need the other one so I could combine them into some horrid being. I said, I know what I'm going to do. I went over there, find a weedle, caught it. Well, I made the ultimate combination, catweed. And the only bird that I did catch, except for Fenboy Hooters, the owl, I caught was Sparrow. Good Since birdie. the kid wanted a sparrow so bad, instead of getting a plant with the biggest lips to man fucking kind. So, I just traded with them. And I chuckled as I knew what I was gonna do to that goddamn blend. Right after fusing my cat pee and weed into the cat or no, I grabbed my balls and I made my way to Brock's gym, only for the manliest of men. As a man who never lifted more than 10 pounds, I was screwed as I was utterly crushed, probably.